Today on Newsbreak, we have the coverage of all the senior activities that are happening throughout the day. Also, a very successful night for Spirit Lake Park Okoboji Soccer. Last night, we have the highlights. All this and more on this Wednesday, May 18th, 2016. Good afternoon, SHS. I'm Tyler Jones. And I'm Ira Finance. Now, some of your top stories for today. This morning, the senior breakfast was held for the graduating class of 2016. Omelets, donuts, and yogurts were served by several of the teachers. Mr. Schmidt went on to give speeches about the senior class. There was a sports send-off for track, double tennis, and Special Olympics this morning in the West Gym. Track will be competing in Des Moines tomorrow, and we will have the coverage. The double tennis will compete on May 27th, and we will also have results for that event over the next few days. Girls track, please turn in your uniforms to Coach Heinitz in room 408 by today. Juniors and seniors, if you would like to help out with the 4th grade track and field day, please sign up in the office. The day is Friday, May 20th from 1 to 3. Seniors, Mr. Ferks has shared a Google Doc with you outlining instructions on how to back up your Google files. Please take the time to read these instructions and your school-issued accounts will be disabled. Also, freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, all library materials are due by May 20th. If they are not returned, you will be responsible for the replacement cost of the item, which will need to be paid prior to checking out for this summer. The last day to register for fall ILCC courses will be Friday. Contact Mrs. Nelson ASAP if you're interested. So is the weather continuing its trend of sunshine? Sunshine, sunshine. sunshine. Easy, easy last week for me because there's just so much um, sun around the area. Only windy on Sunday. I'll be a little bit of a concern. But other than that, even warmer as we go into the weekend and we'll bring some storms in for next week. But uh, we don't worry about that just yet. But uh, looking beautiful out there. I'll start with the sky cams here. Here's where sky cam HD first. Another nice day out there, a lot of sunshine. Look how calm the waters are on the Okoboji Source Sky Cam. Just absolutely clear out there, and you can see the clear skies and the calm water out there on the Emporium Sky Cam as well. Just another beautiful day out there, and this afternoon's looking great as well. 67 degrees at 4 o'clock, 68 at 5 o'clock, feeling like 72 out there with those light winds out of the south southeast, making it feel even warmer. 67 degrees for the high today. Light winds continue tonight with a low of 46, more clear skies out there. Then as we go into the rest of the week, looking great as well. 68 there on Friday, 74 warming up for the weekend, 77 for graduation day on Sunday, but it will be a little bit windy out there. Storm chances come in for Monday afternoon and evening with 74 degrees, warming up to almost 80 degrees by next Tuesday. Back to you guys. Taking a look at sports for today, it was senior night for the girls' SLPO soccer team as they took on MOC. The JV started off the night with a big win, putting up three goals on them. SLPO winning 3-0. On the varsity side, MLC picked up a goal in the first half, making it 1-0. SLPO scored with 33 minutes left, making it tied for the rest of the game, going into overtime. Hannah Pullman scored the winning shot, making it 2-1. SLPO took the victory win over MLC. SLPO boys also took on MLC for the last regular season game. The JV boys would allow six goals from MLC, making it 6-0. SLPO managed to score two goals, but MLC took the win 6-2. On the varsity side, SLPO attempted many shots in the first half, but none would hit. Jake Dodge scored about 20 minutes into the game. Going into halftime, another shot was made, and SLPO was up 2-0. A penalty kick was scored by MOC, making it 2-1. Defense was picked up in the second half by SLPO, and they would hold MOC to one point, taking the win 2-1. That is look at your sports. Back to you guys. Well, awesome. that was a big win last night, yeah? Yes, I guess the number seven ranked right team with one A, and got a big game coming up. Tanner's got a little more information on that. Yeah, next Monday is the first round playoffs um, for some boys soccer against Spencer. Uh, it is home, and it's six dollars to get in since it's state um, playoffs, and it is whiteout. So yeah, teams whiteout, big rivalry game. Yes. Of course, we beat them at, at their place, they beat us at our place, so it's it's going to be a very, very good game. We're going to get some extra bleachers and such out there. Um, bring all your friends, it's going to be a, a big game. So, are they ranked? No. Um, they are no longer ranked. Oh, but we're on rank as well. But <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. But MLC is not in our class, though, right? Yep, they're in one day. They're going to do very well in one day. Um, we're good friends with, with the MLC team. Uh, uh -huh. We wish them good luck, so. Okay. okay, well, that's all the time for today. Thanks for watching this week. Have a